Hey everybody, my name is Kitty and welcome back for another video of Star Wars The Old Republic. We're going to continue this series, boys. Just got back into the spaceport of uh, Taris, right? That's what we were uh, we needed to do next. So let's go ahead and do that. We're not going to waste any more time here. We got some people already waiting for us. It looks like it's Torian. So that might be interesting. I think Torian's probably going to become my new companion or something like that. Champion. I've, I've got You're a feeling at least. Big game. We've been set to collect the traitor from you. Uh, what trader? What are you talking about? Help yourself. He's in the cargo bay. We'll make this quick. Oh, they're talking we about the uh, the champion. other guy. Oh, yeah, that we got. Okay. I thought they were talking about back or something. I was missing something here. Um, I want to come with you. Yeah, I knew it. He's going to be our next companion, which is fine by me. Uh, always room for one more. This is in the shuttle. Well, there's always room for one more. I don't mind you tagging along. Not along for the ride. I mean to serve, join your hunts, earn respect for my clan. What do you say, big guy? Give me this honor. Uh, just follow order or else, you know what? Uh, be, be ready to work. Keep pace or I'll leave you behind. Got it? I'm ready. Uh, let's go. We're going to have uh, Mandalorian with him, you? boys. No. An actual one. You can finally show your face, and now you're running off. Try to make something of yourself, Arutal. Ready when you are. All right, let's go then. We're gonna have a uh, brand new guy now. That's that's really cool, actually. I like that the fact that uh, we have him. I will much prefer uh, Torion over Mako, even though I've got like uh, some sort of relationship, like a uh, romantic relationship going on with Mako. Uh, I feel like that was just a force thing for me, right? I'm gonna try to flirt with anyone I see, except for the guys, obviously. So, you know, it is what it is. Every girl I see, I'm gonna try to flirt in the game. So, it's not like Michael is that special, boys. But Torian is, in my opinion. He seems like a, 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 a the most awesome character we're gonna have so far as a companion. Since he's a Mandalorian and everything. Let me just go ahead and use the intercom already. Actually, we, do, we did get... Um, Finally, our coins for the cartel market. Uh, there are five hundreds. Uh, obviously, we're not going to be able to buy anything in particular, but I could probably do what I could do with that. Could always get that armor. That that's. I mean, the Revan armor is so cool, boys. But I don't think I want to waste money on that. That's for sure. But uh, there's so many, like there's so many cool armors. I just want to get a new Mandalorian armor. I feel like the. I grew tired already of the orange uh, armor that I already have. I kind of want to switch it up, right? Uh, maybe, you know, this one looks uh, alright. It's Commander's Vizsla's armor and whatever. I'm looking for something that, uh, I mean, that looks cool, right? That looks kind of cool. An armor that has a mask on and everything. Mandalorian Clansman armor. That's kind of cool too. There's a lot of uh, cool armors and everything. We can figure it out in due time, I guess. Right? Yeah, we can probably figure it out in due time. There's the official, right? The uh, original armor of the Mandalorians, which is Cassius's fit. Interesting. We don't have anything else, it looks like. I'm going to try to look around. Nah, not really anything uh, worth uh, looking aside for, aside from that. We do have col the collection though, which I'm going to yeah, go ahead and get rid of this screen. So we got the collection ar armors. This is all the f the, f the armors I've got. I c uh, this is the one I can always get now because I bought that for uh, that ability. Uh, but the other armors that I've got, let me see real quick. I do have the uh, best of the chance armor, which I it's not going to be use uh, you really useful. Uh, Darth Malak's armor as well. It's not going to be useful if I don't, you know, uh, need them, right? If I'm not a Jedi, I don't feel like I'm going to need that. Anything else that would be interesting, though? For a guy like me, at least, that's a Jedi robe, not really. That's the one I have. I can't really... I wonder if I just can simply change the armor, maybe? That would be pretty awesome if I could just change the armor. I don't think I have anything else going on. I will right, we'll just save our money, I guess. Let's just talk. This is Torian. He'll be 
joining us, so get properly introduced. Always room for one more in my book. I'm Mako. Golf Renault, at your service. Pleasure. Not much to look at, but it's home. No complaints. All right, Mako, find him a room. I improved this ship a lot. Uh, not like uh, you to you gotta say. All right, you know what? Make a f uh, make him uh, find a room. All right, find him, so let's find him a room. Out. Come on, I'll give you the tour. Nice. Now I know we hit the big time. Really? Why is that? What makes you say that? Offers have been piling up since we won the Great Hunt. Mostly not worth our time, but I think we finally struck the mother load. Some bigwig from a DAS Corp just sent us an offer with more zeros than I can count. Really? Or I like the sound of that. I'm thinking I don't get enough work in the private sector these days. Get this. It isn't even for a bounty. They want you to endorse their new line of battlefield adrenals. They're willing to give their current spokesperson the boot, but only if you pick up the contract as soon as possible. What? Sponsorship? What the hell is this? Free advertising? Hey, it's free advertising. I don't Plastering care. Plastering my face all over the hollow is gonna do wonders for business. Once wasn't enough for you? I think I saw that. Next time, show your good side if you've got one. We're supposed to visit a Das Corp's plant on Quest to talk terms. Let me handle the negotiations and we'll be rolling in credits. I'll only take a 30% cut. Not how I'd want to be remembered. So, we headed to Quest? Uh, I'll think about it. Let's uh, let's not keep them waiting. Let's not keep them waiting. Plotting a course for Quest now. I'll yeah, let's go to Quest right now. Us. Hey, they want to do sponsorship. I don't even have to do a bounty or anything. I just have to wear some boots or whatever. Is. Which is interesting. Be careful if we head there. <laughs> That's kind of interesting. We've got a brand new gun for us, which is uh, awesome. That's exactly what we're going to need. Just see real quick. Uh, so we're going to equip that to us, obviously. Now this one is level 70. So we're going to equip it to some uh, to the guy that we know we're going to use now. Which is this guy. Actually he's got a bigger gun. So this guy's more of a big gun type of thing. Which is fine I guess. He's got these armors. I am going to give him uh, the... I'm going to give him that. So she can uh, get rid of the helmet. I'm going to give him the helmet uh, now. So at least he can definitely be a Mandalorian for days now. An actual Mandalorian. Dynamic mount. I can't equip him further than that right now. I wanted to like give him the colors and everything, but it doesn't seem like I can right now. I don't know. We'll figure it out, boys. Let me just see. Uh, what about Mako though? She has a 62 gun. I'm gonna give her a 70 gun. That's pretty good. Uh, Galt. He's got a big gun himself. Okay. And what about him? He's got an 82 gun. That guy is, has a really good gun. All right. Well, I think we're good, boys. Let's go. Let's continue. I already have the XP unlocked and everything. The XP thing. All right. So we're good. Let's go ahead. Oh, actually, we do have people that we need to talk to, I guess. There's a lot of companions. Uh, all of our companions actually need to talk to us. So let's uh, talk to Mako first. She's closest to us. Been running some diagnostics on the ship. Hyperdrive seems to need a little TLC. We ought to get it looked at. What's worse than a neglected hyperdrive? Uh, a neglected Mako? Oh my. <laughs> you could probably use some TLC too. Damn. All work and no play makes for a dull slicer. I wouldn't exactly say no to a vacation. We should get away. We should go somewhere. Just you and me. Look, I like you. You're fun, and you look good in door steel, but... It's a really bad idea for us to get involved. Why is that? makes business and pleasure, you know? It leads to trouble. Could be worth it. A huh. little trouble might be fun. Don't hold your breath, fake guy. Yeah, she's pushing me right now. What's, what's going on here? She's not going through with it, boys. Let me just see real quick. How is she not going through with it right now? Look. Influence. Uh, maybe it doesn't work, the whole thing. The system doesn't seem to work right now uh, in the ship. I'm going to have to figure this out, boys. But and I'm trying my artist, my damn artist right now. Torian, what about you? Thanks for the help on Terrace. Decent of you to let me in on the kill. You didn't have to do that. Just part of the, the hunt, really. It wasn't exactly charity. 
Jacone was my target. You got me close to him. Works for both of us, then. Looking forward to this. Not everyone gets to fight beside the champion of the Great Hunt. Let's get to work, then. Uh, it's quite an, in an experience. Good to have you along. Well, it's good to have you along. Always glad to have another good hand. I'll pull my weight. Say the word. I'm ready to move out. Alrighty then. That's good. Actually, I do want to look at something really quick for my uh, character. Uh, right? Hide head slot? I don't want to hide that. I don't know why. I don't want to show my dark side corruption either. The unify the colors for this guy. Can I not unify? I don't know why I can't do that. Alright. Figure it out, boys. Let's talk to Galt. Oh, it's good to relax. This is as close as I'm getting to it these days. We all need rest. Everyone has limits. Are you kidding? I'm in my prime. I'm talking about trying to unwind here. I mean, really unwind. It's unsettling. I've spent so long keeping one step ahead of somebody, I can't believe I've lost them for good. At least when I'm out with you, I usually know where the blaster fire's coming from. Keeps my mind off trouble, mostly. If you want me to give you more time to loaf around, forget it. Are you even listening? The last thing I need is more time to myself. Let's see how easily you brush off your old instincts and catch 40 winks after you've spent 30 years bounty hunting. Give me inform about this. No rest for the wicked. You can sleep when you're dead. It's so nice to have a partner concerned with my health and well-being. Come on, I think I've had my fill of all this cheering up. Gods, I really don't like you. Nothing personal, I really just don't like you. I don't like how you... How you, you hack know, and you're everything. Pretty quick it's to sniff just ridiculous. Out for profit. You sniffed out a... Uh, okay. Uh, what do you want... Um, what do you want now? Flattery won't get whatever you're angling for. Oh, I was just making an observation, but now that you mention it, I wonder how much more lucrative our little partnership could be if you applied that intuition to something other than bounty hunting. Why would I do that for? Quit trying to con me. No, back to your old self, I see. Leave me out of your scheming. Don't sell our partnership short. My abundance of skills and expertise are always at your disposal. It just so happens that most of my expertise is in crime. Mull it over. I hate to see so much potential go to waste. My god, he's got a lot of, this, uh, of things to say to me. Oh, good lord. All right then, Galt. I've been thinking it over, and I see a lot of room for improvement maximizing your profits. Take catching me, for example. Sure, you got a nice bounty from the Great Hunt, but why stop there? You just need to use a little imagination. Get to the point, Galt. A few words in the right ears, and you could make a lot of money on poor Tiresias's remains. If you don't mind double-crossing crime lords. Offer the body, see who bikes, rob them blind. <laughs> Couldn't be simpler. I get dirty enough handling my client's funny business, thanks. Think of it as just another job. I'm a client with a strong personal interest in seeing Tiresias avenged. And what better tribute to the late me than ripping off the scum who put me there? That's not gonna happen, Galt. Man, you still wanna talk to me. Good lord, he's really trying hard. So, that suggestion I had involving my duplicate? Turns out there are a lot of folks out there who've still got a bone to pick with the late Tiresias Loci. A little friendly competition couldn't hurt our final take. I'm thinking an auction would do the trick. Too much of a bother. Do I look like I have time for that? No, of course not, but I do. Give me some time off the ship, and I can handle the whole thing by proxy. The only finger you'll have to lift will be the one accepting your credit transfer. Be careful while you're gone. Don't cross me. You know what? Don't cross me. Try anything cute, and it'll be a two-for-one sale. Cute's not really my style. Besides, I'm still recovering from the last time we crossed each other. All right, he's going, right boys. You know it. He's going for the, uh, the sales thing. Why? No parade? No, oh, not even a cake? How oh, about at least mustering a good to see you for the guy holding your share of the credits? Show me the money. I'd like to see my take before it wanders off. It's not like it'd be going far. I live here, remember? You're cut. 
pretty good take, considering the expenses. The bidders really couldn't wait to take Tiresias off our hands. What expenses? Middlemen, venues, security, incentives, everything necessary to ensure a smooth transaction with half the underworld in one place. Three really? pirate crews, ten free traders, two exchange bosses, half a dozen huts, one I don't even remember crossing. Kept licking his lips, and uh, I think his name was Druga. It was quite the rogues gallery. A lot of familiar faces. Brought back memories, let me tell you. Oh my god. That was quite a, uh, a venue right there. Good lord. It's, it's got so much things to say to me, man. I'm trying to go to Quesh right now. Whatever, man. This m hey, this, have this go oh, through pretty, pretty long, man. From the Royal Museum. I thought we could make sure these get put to better use. I like the way you think. Uh, I don't need handouts. Keep your loot. I work for a living. Fine. I wanted some decorations anyway. Brighten up the cell, you know. All right. No, Auric. He's got. He's still got something to say to me. Oh, uh, how much? Fuck you, dude. Man, I'm done talking to this guy. He's gonna talk for me with me for the uh, for hours. It seems like like I'm not gonna waste my time with him. That's seems like a waste of time right now. So let's go. I'm gonna use my ship to travel to Quest because I don't know if uh, if there's something that's gonna happen in the all terminal or whatever. But let's go ahead and go to uh, Quest. There we go. Level 36 to 7. Okay. We just had to travel there, I guess. Uh, I'll see you guys on the uh, land itself, I guess. Alright, boys. Check it, look at, take a look at this. Just joined um, a clan, right? Or a guild. I just got invited, so I'm going to accept. Guilds usually give you... I'm going to take that right now. Um, guilds usually... Uh, give you a lot of bonuses right they give you stuff you can give money you get money out of them via the leaders and everything so guilds is really important if you want to have a guild part of the mandalorian neo crusaders which is pretty cool so officially a, a true mandalorian boys look at all this part of the mandalorians right here boys um so right now we've got a lot of people right here so, right seems uh, kind of fun i'm going to uh thank them really quick all right, we got a couple of things here. We do, we did get a gun. I got the vaccination and everything. Uh, use the shuttle to land on Quesh, which is uh, fine. I'm gonna, actually, you know what? Abandon this shit. I don't need that. Uh, all right, so we got the thing. First things first. We did, we did get that. So I'm gonna equip that right now. We got a better gun already. So already another upgrade for my gun. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and switch partners here. I want Torian on my Just crew, or with right? me. She's already right. level 16, though, with me. But that's because of the whole flirt thing, uh, I'm pretty sure. Let's see really quick. So this guy, uh, Torian, can you now change? Yes, you can uni unify the uh, the colors, so that's good. Now he actually looks perfect with his armor and everything. That's uh, really awesome. On my side, I feel like we should be fine as well. Yeah, we're good. We're way good. I like that. When he has no use, any more uses for his armor, I might be tempted to just take it, right? Uh, I like his armor a lot and everything. Eventually, if I just see an armor uh, that I can take, I'll probably take it. Let's make it to Taris, boys. We're finally there. there or, or not Taris, Quesh. There we go. We just came back from Taris. Let's go. Let me just go ahead and use this uh, thing right here. So, we have to travel there. It's not that far away. Talk to you uh, while we do that, boys. It's cool. I like the that uh, right here. Like these mounts, right? They don't give you uh, more speed or whatever. It just looks cooler. I feel like they sh it should be a thing though that gives you more speed to go in one place to another. If you got a like a really big speeder or s or like a walker or something, depending on what you have, right? You go faster. I feel like that's what it should be a thing, but. We'll get. We'll take what we have, I guess. Gotta go all the way around here. This is a longer way than I thought it would be, boys. All right. Just give me. Well, you know what? Look, take a look at Quesh. Quesh is one of my favorite, uh, favorite planets for sure. Uh, I think it might be my favorite, or if not one of my favorite, be just because of the colors, right? It's like it's like spring basically. So every time. It looks beautiful. I, I just love the way it looks. 
Anyways, I'll, I'll see you guys in a second here. Alright, we've arrived, boys. Just gotta get into this place, I believe. No, actually not into this cave. I was about to go the wrong way, I feel like, here. Uh, I probably gotta go around the corner right here onto this side. Yep, that's what I thought. Let's go, boys. I was about to go into the cave for no reason here. We gotta talk to a person in particular. Probably our, spo uh, our sponsor, right? The guy who wants to sponsor us. So that's pretty interesting. Let's go. Let's go ahead and talk to him, boys. So you're my hunter? Yes. Yes, I see it now. The pictures don't do you justice. Excuse my manners. Peyton Swall, Director of Galactic Relations. Thought you suits at least try to impress me. We can discuss the terms of contractual partnership in my office. This way, please. Let's do this. Oh, the contract, I want everything. May I offer you anything? No, I'm good. Just a contract. How can I be of service to a desk corp? Valerie, send in a refreshment cart. Spare no expense. What is this? Now you're stooping low, my guy. Knew I didn't like this. Agent Dahl, Strategic Information Service. I'm placing you under arrest for the murder of Jedi Master Kellyan Jaro and the destruction of the Republic cruiser Aurora. Excuse me? I was under contract. If you got a problem, take it up with my employer. Yeah, that's my employer's to, problem. After you clarify a few things, cooperate, and you might not spend the rest of your life behind bars. <laughs> Fucking Jedi? Night. You spared my life. The courts will take that into consideration if you come peacefully. And this relieve the bounty hunter of weaponry. Cautiously. They're a tricky bunch. I don't like this. I know that How do we get out of this mess, Torian? Shit. Hands off if you want to live. Help me here. I'm sorry, I'm not getting air. I mean, I, I'm not getting out. I, I got caught by the cops, basically. This is not good. Ends up if you want to live. I don't want to kill her. I, she's not part of... So I don't want to kill people that are not part of a bounty. Uh, some gratitude. You know what? Ends up if you want to live. I'm going to pretend this never happened. I suggest you do the same. That's exactly don't what I'm saying. Escape. What do you mean don't let him escape? You stupid fuck. Alright. That's enough. You, you betrayed me, man. I let you live. And there you go after me again. What is your problem? Alright. You know what? It's, it was nothing personal. But now it's definitely personal. You didn't want to make this personal. Uh, tr trust me on that one. That was really ridiculous. Why would they do that? Like, come on now. I didn't do nothing. All I did was my job. For Christ's sake. Now you can be sure that I'm going to uh, think twice before working for the Republic. Just because of that bullshit that just happened. You've only made matters worse for yourself. Fuck this shit. Duly noted. Get this shit out of here. Teach him to mess with Mandos. Kelly and Jaro. You took down the Mandalorian killer. I did? He was my final target in the Great Hunt. Good target. More trouble. We're leaving anyway. Just an inconvenience. Yeah, we're just getting out of here anyways. Let's get the fuck out of here. This is a, the this was the whole thing was just a big trap, boys. Let's just go back to my ship then. Man, that was a waste of time going to Quesh. What the hell is this? All I wanted to do was, it was quick uh, sponsorship and everything. It seems right. It seemed right, right? But got screwed over, man. Got trapped. It was all a trap just because of the Jedi's. They were mad at me for some reason because I did a job, right? Like, come on. A job's a job. I'm going to complete it. All right. Let's go ahead and talk to the crew here. I'll tell them what just happened. Looks like we are... Uh, we, so, we on easy are search now, around. Was a trap. The whole thing was a Republic setup. What? But how? 
That offer letter was 100% legitimate. I traced it back to a DAS Corp and cross-checked all the digital signatures. I don't want excuses. You bring me an offer. Be ready to stake your life on it. I, I, I will. I'm really sorry about this. Oh, hey, look. Bloodworthy's on the line. I'll patch him through. And she fucked up big time right I'm now. Not interrupting. Just wanted to transfer your next target. That is, if you're ready for another blacklist favorite. Why not? Hope your pride is up to it. I'd hate to miss another chance to outdo you. I was hoping you'd say that. Jula's bet you'd call it quits after the first one. This baby's years shy of beating Jacqueline's time, but anything sitting on the blacklist more than a month is real trouble. I'm putting my money on you this time, so try not to get yourself killed. I will. That's our next move. That's our next move. We get back to business. We've got another blacklist mark to deal with. Have the next blacklist bounty's coordinates logged by the time I'm ready to head out. Will do. All right then, boys, let's do this. Uh, we got this and that. All right, good. Man, this is crazy, though. It truly is. The thing is, I wasn't expecting uh, me to get trapped so early on or get caught by the cops, the so-called space cops, right? The, the, the Jedis. I wasn't expecting that at all. They definitely are mad about me killing one of them, but I mean, come on now. That was just my job, right? The Part SIS of the business. I found? 32? Turns out if you search for it in enough super secret Republic databases, it gets noticed. Ran into a little, uh, trouble. Like, if I keep doing this, the chance of mysteriously disappearing goes up dramatically. Sort of trouble. Anything happens to you, I don't know what I'll do. You know, you just can't find another slicer who'll put up with you. Figure there are other, less hazardous channels I can look into. I'll, uh, let you know if I decide to do anything stupid. Or, more likely, let you know after. Whatever. Whatever suits you, Mackle. Alright then. We gotta travel to off. I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Before talking to my companions. Because if I gotta talk to, Qua uh, to Gold one more time. One more time, boys. I swear I'm gonna lose my mind. We gotta use our inter uh, uh, shift's intercom. I'm gonna wait for the... Uh, well, actually, let's just Mako, do it right now. Open a secure channel on the frequency we got from the blacklist. Come on, come on. Signal strength is really poor. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, sorta. This is unexpected. I greet you on behalf of the Chess Ascendancy Bounty Hunter. I am Aristocle Shaw Hadu Militia. This hollow frequency hasn't had an inquiry in quite some time. I believe there were no longer any interesting parties. Well, it's because you look cheap. If your hollow wasn't such junk, you'd probably get more replies. Puff's turbulent atmosphere makes hollow communication nigh impossible. We will have to make you. I need someone to hunt the Trandoshan pirate lord, Renegad Voss. Are you such an individual? May as well ask us to hunt the ghost of Nagas Sato. Never heard of uh, Renegad Voss. The name doesn't ring any bells. A pirate of some renown. He favors lurking in the regions of space you consider uncharted. Our territory, mostly. Renegade Voss has been a blight on Chess shipping lanes and colonies for years. That'll end soon. I'll put him out of business. Deliver on those promises and you'll be generously rewarded. Voss appears to have joined up with the White Moor, a massive confederacy of pirates pillaging hot starship graveyard. Their raids have reduced our salvage operations to smoking wreckage. Uh, any other White Moor bounties? Boss, your only target of interest here? He's the only target you need concern yourself with. We've permitted the Empire to use Hoff for strategic purposes in exchange for their assistance dislodging the pirates. Imperial soldiers will handle the white war. However, Boss is worth more to us alive. They want him alive. The blacklist was good as uh, was a good call. Alive is fine by me. Works for me. Executions are messy. Our patrols recently captured one of the White Moor pirates out in the wastes. It may be able to point you to Voss once you arrive. I'm transmitting credentials that will allow you unrestricted access to Hoth's surface. Use them to travel to these coordinates. Contact me when you've secured Voss. I will do. 
All right, this co all the communications was all over the place. All right then, let's do that. We got uh, go they all want to talk to me. All right then, let me just see really quick. Uh, meet with the warden. We gotta go after the white moth too, which is interesting. What sort of jobs are coming up? Hunting, mercenary work. Uh, be ready for anything. You never know in this business. Should keep me on my toes. Been in a few skirmishes. Treaty with the Republic made real fighting scarce. I'd like to see something worthy. Uh, we fight what we're paid for. We're not looking for glory, Torian. We're doing a job. Sometimes they're the same thing. Mandalorians need battle. It's the only way we test ourselves. Mando without war is like a starship without space. No promises. You know what? I actually don't care. I'm not getting mixed up in some war just so you can feel good about yourself. I never asked you to. Look, I like Torian, but uh, I'm not getting mixed up in some bullshit. That's happening, that's for sure. Alright, Torian, you got something else to say? Been watching you work. You're good with that blaster. Well, they expect me to borrow it. Well, you know what? Thanks. Gotta be a good shot in this business. I've seen hunters who couldn't hit the broadside of a dreadnought. Nice to see a professional in action. Might even learn a few things hanging around you. Alright, thank you, Dantorian. Good, I like compliments like that. Uh, what about you, Mako? And the other stuff again? Remember how I said I'd avoid SIS databases for the time being? Decided this was a good time to take a crack at the encryption on that SIS creep Carteri's datapad. The encryption is crazy. Someone threw a solid wall of credits into keeping this thing secure. Sounds like something big. Anyone goes to that much trouble to keep a secret. It's gotta be something serious. That's the scary part. I mean, I'm seriously getting the creeps now. What's my family involved in that's worth this kind of money to the Republic? It's really not our problem. It's not really our problem. Whatever it is, stay out of it. We don't need to borrow trouble. That's probably the smart approach. Anyway, thanks for listening to me babble. Much appreciated. No problem. Alright then. Uh, does she have anything else to say? No? Alright, so Galt. Please tell me you're not going to talk to me for hours again. Alright? How much bet he wants to talk to me again? Oh my god. Alright, fuck you. I'm talking to him on my own time, boys. I don't have time for this shit. Galt just wants to talk forever. That's all he wants to do is talk, talk, and talk. We're gonna go in the next video to off, right? We're gonna travel there. We didn't do anything really anything interesting in this video. Uh, wasn't like too much stuff happening, but we did finish up our main story in the uh, in Taris, right? Uh, we got to the spaceport. We got a new companion in Torian. Then we went to Quesh and um, got trapped by a bunch of uh, Republic agents, which is interesting. Then we got back here and basically traveled to off to our new contract. Uh, basically, we didn't really do anything, right? Except for to talk to our companion. That's mostly what we did. But some of the videos are going to be more like that where we spend more time talking to the companions. Hopefully not a lot about Galt, though. I really don't like Galt. Michael is fine. Torian, I kind of like him. Galt, I really don't like him. I hate this guy. Like, I despise him. I don't even know why I kept him. He should have been dead. I, I don't know why the story wanted me to keep him alive, but whatever. Uh, I'll see you guys for the next one. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Keep it easy.